hello guys welcome to my channel is something and in this video tutorial i will gonna show you how to fix a step of error so how can fix a step of error let's get started before starting of the video i humbly request you please subscribe my youtube channel for more updates so let's see start okay guys in this video tutorial i will share a couple of method to fix this type of error the first method is that first of all go to your google search in there and download that access and install so download break x click on it click on download now download and install in your pc After completing that, I hope your problem is fixed. But if your problem is still, then you can try a second method. The second method is that uh, update your window. Go to your settings of your windows. Go to your windows update and download and install in your PCs. So it's required for a few minutes to complete this process. The third method in, uh, is that install a Visual C++. Um, so go to your uh, Google search engine and type with download click on it scroll down and download according to your uh, network operating Click on save and install in your PC. So downloading will be started and it's required for a few seconds to complete this process. Now install in your PC. Now here is and close it. After doing this test, I hope your problem is fixed. But if your problem is still, then you can try a next method. The next method is that close unnecessary apps. Right click, go to your task manager. And if any unnecessary apps runs, then close, select and close it. The next method is that update, um, update your graphic driver. And uh, after uh, updating graphic driver, restart your computer. And I'm sure that after doing this step, your problem is fixed. But if your problem is still, then you can try our next method. The next method is that in the search box, type a CMD and open a command prompt, right click run as administrator. After uh, opening that, type a SFC space slash scan now and press enter. After that, it's required of a few minutes to complete this process. After completing that, type exit and exit the command prompt and after that restart your computer. And I'm sure that after doing this test, your problem is fixed. I hope this video is helpful for you. 
Thanks for watching and please subscribe my YouTube channel.